Star, the second annual Star Wars Reads Day. It's um, a program put together and celebrated across bookstores, across the nation by bookstores and libraries, where we're just celebrating reading and our love of Star Wars and with the great publishers of Del Rey and Dark Horse and DK, all Star Wars publishers have come together um, to celebrate Star Wars, Star Wars and reading. Here we go. Give us your best picture. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Is that okay? That's good. Good job, Jonas. Um, we did this last year at the library, but of course we needed a new home for it this year since we don't have space at the, our current location in the old Borders building. So I thought to ask um, Eric and Lawrence Create if they would help um, help us host it and create other um, activities to do for the program, which I'm so thrilled about because there's no way that Jenny Cook and I could have come up with the lights, you know, the green screen lightsaber battle, or um, the Darth Vader voice changer, or even show Carrot Wars, or have these great projections on the walls. Like I just think being here and with Lord's Creates has like added so much more to the day. And what a better place to have a Star Wars program than in a maker space when I, th I would think that a lot of people that are involved in the maker movement are really into Star Wars but also can build all the contraptions and things that you might see in Star Wars. So um, yeah, that's basically it. We've had the trash compactor and the lightsaber making station as well as snacks and drinks and what we call a pop-up library where we bring a bunch of library books and just you are able to check them out on site. Uh, trivia, the feeding job of the hut, um, beanbag toss. Um, it's just been a really great day. And to kick everything off, we've got Andy Stowers who will do a reading from Shakespeare's Star Wars. It is a period of civil war. The spaceships of the rebels striking swift from base unseen have gained a victory o'er the cruel and galactic empire now adrift. <laughs> Amidst the battle, rebel spies prevailed and stole the plans to a space station vast, whose powerful beams will later be unveiled and crush a planet. Tis the Death Star blast. Pursued by agents sinister and cold, now Princess Leia to her home doth flee. Delivering plans and a new hope they hold of bringing freedom to the galaxy. In time so long ago begins our play in star crossed galaxy far, far away. What's your Star Wars name? Anakin Skywinds. <laughs> okay. What's your favorite Star Wars movie? Um, I'd say Return of the Jedi. That's a good, good choice. <laughs> Tell me uh, how you perfected the Wookiee call. Kind of took a while, but kind of watching Star Wars a lot kind of helped. How many times do you think you've seen it? Any of them? Um, counting all of the times I've watched it? Yep. I'd say almost a hundred. Wow. Well, congratulations. Well, I just hope that we can continue to partner with Lawrence Creates with the library. I think it's a great partnership. And um, yeah, I'm looking forward to Star Wars Reads Day next year. I'd rather my escape from the world. I must thank the Lord. And here I'll do them here. I'm not going to open the world.